choosing the right generator for camping, caravanning, or four-wheel driving, it sounds like it could be a little bit of a challenge, but it's really not that hard. All you need to do is start by checking out how many watts each of your units actually uses. Now that's pretty simple. All it means is going to the information panel on the back of those devices and just adding it up. So for the protection of your generator, it's essential to choose a power rating that is suitable for all your needs. And now that you've added up that maximum number of watts, now it's time to start looking at the generators themselves. For full driving, I tend to use this Yamaha EF2000 IS. The Yamaha EF2000 IS model generates non-continuous peak power of 2000 watts. And I like it because it's fairly compact, it can fit just in the back of my four wheel drives, but it also has enough grunt to power all sorts of different accessories. My fridges, laptops, and for me, powering up camera batteries in the bush. And the reason I like this particular model is because it is whisper quiet, but it's also an inverter generator. So that doesn't only mean that it is super efficient, it means that it can power really sensitive electrical appliances because it produces pure sine wave power. Now this means that it doesn't matter if I'm running a high-tech laptop, powering camera batteries, all sorts of gear, this unit will actually give me even more stable power than the 240 volts I use at home. But if you don't need all that much power, the compact size and lightweight EF1000 IS 1kVA unit is the perfect choice for camping and short four-wheel drive trips. This unit is a great option if you're going to power portable fans, want to recharge some batteries, or even want to recharge the battery under the hood of your four-wheel drive. It's nice and compact, it's also lightweight, so it means that it can be stored on the roof rack of your four-wheel drive, in your camper trailer, wherever really. Now you might think that the 2000 watt unit would run a lot of those devices, but where generators tend to struggle is in maximum heat, like 40 degree Aussie heat, trying to power an aircon unit. That is where your 2.4 kVA really comes into its own. When you're wanting to use the generator under maximum load, at searingly hot temperatures outside. This has got that little bit of extra grunt over the 2000 model, and the reason it's got that is because you do need a lot of grunt if you want to power your air conditioning units, lights, microwaves, TVs, just about anything really. So there you go, Yamaha really does offer a complete range of generators for all of your outdoor adventures. For your nearest Yamaha dealer, or to view Yamaha's entire range of generators, go to www.generatoryamaha.com.au or call 1300 735 440.